That's exactly right. And Deputy Matthew Martin told me that he hasn't given out any BUIs today. That's boating under the influence. Even with the warmer weather we had last week, the last couple of days, he says everyone has been boating safely here on the lake. Of course, it is much colder and rainier outside. There's no one out there right now. So really everyone here in Kirkland is gearing up for tomorrow. Rain or shine. All right. Come aboard. The King County Marine Rescue Unit was out on the water this 4th of July weekend. All right, you want to cast off? They were one of the only vessels out on the water on this drizzly day. A lot of boat owners have got their boats ready for the season. They just haven't been able to take them out. Number 22, have the details. RP is waiting. Number two, come. They're taking part in the National Operation Dry Water Campaign, but so far this weekend, no BUIs have been handed out. The boaters in Washington are quite educated when it comes to BUI, like we just don't see it a lot. Coming up! This year, the summer sort of hasn't arrived, so our boaters haven't shown up in big numbers yet. Passengers can drink alcohol on a boat. It's the operator that can't be under the influence. If they're responsibly boating, we're not likely to have a BUI contact with them. BUI isn't their only focus this weekend. How you doing? Good. I just want to come talk to you about your skier flag. They were out making sure everyone followed safe boating rules. I want you guys to have a good time, obviously. Right, but I have to tell you, you can't sustain that. While it is officially summer, they're gearing up for a possibly warmer holiday tomorrow. You guys familiar with Lake Washington? They aren't the only ones waiting for a warm up on the water. <laughs> That's right. We got our lucky days and we got our bad days, so yep. we go with the punches. When the sun is out, Woodmark Waterfront Adventures has all of their vessels out. We're hoping for it to turn back to, to sun here pretty soon. Right, they say with the Pacific Northwest, it's always a gamble, but they are filled up with bookings tomorrow. And as more people head to the lake, the Marine Rescue Unit will also be there. We want to see people get out and enjoy themselves. Uh, that's why our unit exists, so people can safely enjoy the water. Deputy Martin tells me that the most dangerous vessel on the water last season was actually paddle boards. He says that each person is required to have a life vest while on the paddle board, but many times they don't wear one. If someone were to fall off, that's when they get into trouble. In Kirkland, I'm Kristen Goodwillie, King 5 News.